All right, so we have just found some more evidence of Horton here's a who. Um, all right, there it is, everyone. Uh, take a good look at it. That's the same elephant species we see in Horton here's a who. Uh, it's E, ear egg elephant. Now, we don't get much description for this. E uh, I don't know if there's going to be anything egg else on elephant. it. Hey, don't pause, do e e e All right, there was F nothing else on it. But this is just some more evidence that Horton is actually... I was kind of wrong on this one. Horton is actually a god. Horton, Horton is not a god. That's what I meant. I, I meant he's not a god. He's not god. Don't. He is not... Yeah? <laughs> Alright, hold on, guys. Like, there's quotes that you just... Someone says, and you just have to, like, quote it. Alright, I'm recording real quick. All right, so this guy from Green Eggs and Ham, right? Yeah. He has, everyone agrees that this one is most likely the female wearing a hat. That's the female gender. But now, if you want to see the male gender, it's this one. It's the big F. You can see it right there. They have extremely similar neck hair. But this one is kind of like a peacock phenomenon. What, you guys agree? Yeah. It's and it's working. It's working. It's extremely attractive. That face tells it all. That's extreme. That's an alpha male. That's an Whoa! alpha. Whoa! That's alpha. Everyone agrees that that's an alpha male look. That's alpha that's male. Hilarious, bro. All right. Okay. We'll be back in a sec. Alpha, I got alpha ammo. Just the goat on the boat. All right. Really small oh, thing to note is this goat is from Green Eggs and Ham. Uh, it doesn't play a big role, but, you know, it's another connection. Alright, so we found yet again another connection. These two little guys over here, which my friend Ryan pointed out, are from Hop, Hop and Pop. Hop and Pop, so... I got ammo! These, these two little brats. Check them out. Or maybe it could be the same species of that, so, yeah. Yeah. Right. Is it when you? The big Z. Big D. This is big another connection. This one right here, big N. This looks extremely like the bears from the Lorax. If you, we can find a picture right there. Now, of course, this is the animated version, which we are not following. But I don't know if there's any Why? real good pictures of the bears in the books. So this will have to do for now. Hey, stop! Yeah. All right, so we just found out that there was there was another picture of a king. The humans in the Lorax are actually a uh, what would you say capital? Monarch. No, it's a ca no. They're a capitalistic monarchy because it's all about capitalism. But there's a monarchy. You know, how, historically, though, historically speaking, though, capitalism and monarchies don't mix well. Normally, it's mercantilism and monarchies. That maybe, mean. maybe that's why it crashed, and the cat in the hat became the ultimate god in the future. Are you spoiling it? I am I spoiling mean, it. I'm sorry. Best link, but about him coming back. Also, the reason why this is in the Lorax is because it's got the duck. So yeah. All right, it's called one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. In this story, we see, I think, at least, uh, what's what's their names? Like, Sam and T Sally. Sam and Sally from Cat in the Hat. On a tuffle of tree, nonetheless. I don't know if one's a girl or if they're both boys. I'm not for they're sure. Both. It's a girl and a boy. That's what I'm saying. Look at that. They're And they're, t and they're on a tuffle of tree, but it's, like, browned. So you can tell that this is... Before the Lorax, where all the trees are dead. Well, no, this is like... Or, or when all the trees are coming back. No, no, in, in this cinematic... Oh, no, it wouldn't be a cinematic yeah, universe. It would be a... Um, in... Like, book universe. Uh, but, yeah. And uh, but this next one, I really want to talk about, because... Hot, hot sun. Oh, actually. me, oh, my, so. oh, me, oh, my... But a lot of funny things go by. Some have two feet. This is crazy That's to me. A lot of fish. We see Horton. 
Horton before his prime, when he was a chubby child. We also see, I don't know, I can't really define any of those. They're all in black and white. Whoever wants this can have the rest of them. Mm. Hey, I want some of that. But, uh, I want like, check this out. What do you think about the Horton? I, I just started a Horton. The Horton incident. Oh, uh, let's see. That's a lot Horton. of dead fish. That's definitely Horton. What about you, Connor? You think it's Horton? Yeah, that's Horton. Or hey, Horton has the... Hair. He's definitely Horton. But as a child. Blue fish, dead fish. That's what I'm saying. The, the rest of them are... Alright. Red. There. This guy, this this picture here, uh, my friend's saying that it is uh, the green eggs and ham guy, but I think it looks more like Cat in the Hat's uh, drug addicted uh, dad actually, because like just just got in a very bad condition. What do you guys think about that? Definitely the brother. I mean, he's got seven dad. fingers, so there's dad. something wrong. With him. <laughs> yeah, there's something went wrong. With him. It looks like the dad of the Grinch and Cat in the Hat. Yes. What brothers. if Grinch and the Hat, Grinch and the Cat, and the cat, and the cat are, are related? Are brothers? Oh my God! This goes really deep. And they and they left and they basically kicked. So they kicked the Grinch out because he didn't have his father's abnormal fingers. But in, oh my God! And I forgot the Cat in the Hat can do like the magical stuff. Yeah. And so can the they Grinch. Had. That's how the Grinch could shrink down into Whoville. Oh! Yeah! Wow. This is good. This is it. All right, now me and one of my friends called attention to this. This looks like another depiction of Sally and Sam riding a bike. It's all the futuristic stuff. And you'll notice that this looks like Cat in the Hat, but he does not have his hat, so he had to rely on manpower. So it's actually quite interesting. So. Instead of using his hat to do magical stuff, he actually had to do physical labor. <laughs> what do you guys think about it? And it seems as if there's a red cloud of mist behind them. Definitely. You guys have mm -hmm. a lot of thinking over Dr. Seuss. Yeah, it's Dr. Seuss. Right? Connor agrees. Yeah, Connor agrees. Uh, and, or do you agree, Connor? I agree. All right, and what do you think? I agree. Cat in the hat after male pattern baldness. <laughs> <laughs>